And let's get you your first glimpse of what the Ram Mandir looks like, which is days to go for the Pranpratishta ceremony. These videos are on your screen showing you the beautiful work, the handiwork inside the temple. These are the corridors that lead up to the Garb Griha. And you can see the ceiling so beautifully lit up and the intricate carvings are also. You can also hear that constantly there are Ram Bhajans being played there within the Mandir as the countdown is on to the Pran Pratishta. Of course, work continues. But for anyone who questioned whether the Mandir is complete or not, this is the ground floor of the temple that you can see that the corridors are complete. The work is beautiful, intricately done. And uh, this video that we're getting to you exclusively here on India Today shows you exactly how the entire corridor looks right now. Beautifully lit up uh, and really what stands out for anyone looking at this video is the kind of work that's gone into every single stone that's been put in as part of the mandir. Uh, there is still work happening, but this is the first time we're showing you what the interiors of the Ram Mandir looks like. All lit up, absolutely beautiful, intricate carvings work that has been done in the temple. There you have uh, the video from inside the temple. We've been given very, very few glimpses of what the mandir looks like. And this is the first time on India Today that you're seeing a detailed video showing you what kind of work has been done, how beautifully, intricately the work has been done for this temple. It looks like an absolute stunning work of art. Of course, the wait feels extremely long, but in just a few days from now, in just about a week, we're going to be seeing what the temple looks like in its entirety. For the first time here on India Today, we're getting you this video showing you the kind of work that's been put in, the stonework, the murals, all of it coming together to build this absolute marvelous building to bring you this beautiful, beautiful temple. The wait is slowly getting over, but this looks to be one of the corridors leading up to the Garb Griha. You can hear Rambajans in the air. There's still work going on in many of these portions. So there are still workers there working around the clock. But this is some of the bits that are completed. There's been a lot of questions about whether this is going to be an incomplete temple where the Pran Pratishta will take place on 22nd January. And let me just highlight for you that the groundwork, that the ground floor and the first floor, the work in the temple is complete in these parts. And that's evident in this video that we're showing you right now, in which you can see uh, that all of the stonework is complete. The tiling, the floor, the walls on the side, the ceiling, all of it complete right now and beautifully brought together. So on January 22nd, while these corridors, as you can see, uh, look completely done, will be shown on our screens, we'll also get the first glimpse of the Garb Griha and what the Garb Griha essentially looks like. So this part of the temple, clearly completely done. Puja Shali is joining us from Ayodhya with more on this Puja. Uh, beautiful videos uh, that show us the kind of work that's gone into the Ram Temple and perhaps a fitting answer to anyone who's asking whether the Mandir is incomplete. These are absolutely stunning visuals, uh, as Akshita we can see. Look at the stonework so intricately done. It's the effort of the craftsmen from across the country, from different states have got together and been able to remember what turns out to be a historic moment. And like you also correctly said, the phase one, and specifically with regard to the Sanctum Sanctorum, where the Ramlala idol will be placed, is absolutely complete. And the one reason also um, is that these visuals have come forth as a clarity as a confirmation that this, uh, uh, that this construction of this part of the temple is absolutely ready. There is nothing incomplete about it and that is as per rituals, that is when the Pran Pratishta ceremony uh, is taking place. But just for a second, let's look at these visuals. 
the pillars that have been so intricately uh, that have been set up and made and crafted. Uh, one is the stone that has been brought in from Rajasthan, the craftsmen from Tamil Nadu, from Karnataka. Across the country, the craftsmen and goldsmiths have got together to prepare this part of the Gar Brev. Uh, the stone's work also clearly shows that all of this that has been done by hand reflects the kind of artwork and the efforts that has been put in in the last few months. So yes, this final completion has taken place of the Sanctum Sanctorum area where the Pran Pratishta ceremony will take place that's absolutely ready. And on 22nd January, this is where the Krishna Shila idol will be placed. And also interestingly at this point, remember that this, there is a complete, this area has been completely restricted. Uh, no movement is being permitted in this area. This is where security clearance will also be done. But clearly, what a moment. Stunning visuals after the gold doors that are completed. Official confirmation by the Ram Seas Trust. And then now, uh, the uh, stonework has also been done on the pillars. And also a reminder to the viewers, Aksa, that these stones, that these pillars do not have iron, do not have steel. It is all stone that can last for hundreds of years. True, uh, Pooja, giving us a sense of really what the architecture of the temple looks like. A beautiful video. It's first time you see it here in India today uh, that shows you uh, what the mandir looks like. The inside, we're of course awaiting a glimpse of the Garb Griha, which we will get you very soon on India today. But you will see the splendor of this temple come January 22nd when the Pranpratishta ceremony will take place. Absolutely wonderful work of uh, art there that you see, particularly the kind of intricate carvings, the details that have gone into all of the stones that have brought the mandir together. I'm slipping into a very short break with this footage. We'll be right back getting you all the updates as we count down to the Pranpratishta ceremony.